Hello everyone, Shankar here from ITOP Interior. Recently we did interior work for a 3 BHK flat in classic landmark apartment. Let's see the project. This is the entrance of the flat. Here we made a shoe rack with seating. Below the shoe rack we kept some empty space to keep frequently used footwear. Let's move in. This is the foyer area. As you can see the foyer area is very narrow. Hence we kept it as simple as possible. Here we placed a movable storage unit so that we can move it whenever necessary. We made gypsum fall ceiling in the foyer area with nice wooden look. Here we made a showcase compartition for privacy of the dining area. The outer material we used for this unit is deco paint to give a smooth finish. As you can see there is no black edges or sharp edges like laminate finish. Just beside the dining, we made a puja unit. We made gypsum fall ceiling for the living and dining. We gave marble finished background for the TV unit. Although it's look like marble, but the actual material is laminate. Here is the common wash basin. To protect the wall from water splashes, we used ceramic stone cladding. Because this is the entrance of a bedroom, that's why we made a curved smooth storage unit just below the wash basin. This is the guest bedroom. For this room we made a simple four door wardrobe with a dressing unit. Instead of traditional curtains, we have used blinds for all the windows. Behind the dressing mirror, there are a few shelves 
which can be used for dressing related stuffs. Under the loft we gave spotlights to give a nice look to the wardrobe as well as to glow inner part of the wardrobe. These lights are very useful while a person is sleeping. One can see inside the wardrobe without turning on the main source of light of the room. In the master bedroom, we made a sliding door wardrobe. The doors are with soft close mechanism. Instead of regular edge banding, we have used metallic edges surrounding the doors to give additional strength to the door as well as a royal look. Our client didn't like the kitchen dado tile which was provided by the builder. Hence we have replaced the old tiles with these beautiful wall tiles. As you can see the entire kitchen is in black and white theme. The dado tile also is not an exception. The entire kitchen is handleless kitchen. Here we have placed a wicker basket to keep potatoes and onions. Accessing the corner space of most of the kitchen is a nightmare. Keeping that thing in mind, we have designed the corner doors in such a way so that one can easily access the corner space without any expensive mechanism like magic corner or swing corner etc. Left side of the stove we have placed a cutlery basket. Right side of the stove we have placed an oil plowed basket so that the cook can access both the side very easily while cooking. And right below the stove we gave a big tandem box to keep big vessels and a small tandem box to keep small vessels. Right side of the kitchen we made a tall unit to keep all the groceries. Regardless to say this is the kids room, we made a three door wardrobe here along with a study table and a book rack. We tried to make the room as bright as possible. In addition to that we gave some artificial lights to make it more brighter. Just below the book rack we made a provision for a tube light for reading purpose. We know kids are very naughty and active. Considering that we made the study table edges curved and smooth. To make the wardrobe accessible for kids, we have used lengthy handles for all the doors. contact us for your beautiful home interior work thanks for watching